Good morning, everyone, and welcome to Moss Leaf Farm, where our new Rhea is currently trying to hide in the trees. That's actually kind of adorable. But we grew up our little white baby Ray that we got last time, and it's kind of hiding behind everybody now. So let me see if I can just like, hello, little one. Are you being shy? Are you hiding behind our good friend Tina here? Well, we're going to let Tina go ahead and take care of the things she wants. Oh, and look, Nutmeg is hanging out with Tate. I love it. Oh, they're hula hooping. Ah, and there you are. There is the new baby Raya, and I really like it. I think it's kind of adorable. It looks like an oversized chicken, and it's just hanging out with all the birds right now. But good morning, good morning, good morning. I don't know about you guys, but I have a very busy day ahead of me, so I got my tea, and I was like, oh, maybe I shouldn't Farmville first thing, but by the time I thought about it, Farmville had loaded up. And I am feeling ready to take this on. Ready and... Oh, we got to level 82, by the way, guys. Yes, yes, yes. Gather up those spuds. I wonder if I should grow potatoes this year. Potatoes and, like, peas are one of the few things that I'm really, really good at growing. Just because it's really hard not to be decent at growing potatoes and spuds. Because they, they are very forgiving. Alright, let's see. Let's feed the animals. Down the line. There we go. And since we got to level 82, everybody, that means we could expand over here. All we have to do is make some lavender ginger cookies. So I think between that and the co-op, that's going to be our new goal. So what would we need? Thankfully, I had a little bit of lavender. Okay, is this rye? Yeah, rye flour. And then... We can craft a lavender ginger cookie. So we're going to need to plant a lot of rye. Thankfully, that only takes like an hour to grow. So that won't be so bad. Okay. And you need three of those in order to make one set of cookies. Of course you do. Of course it has to be that hard. Ah, well, let's see how we could do. Actually, I like the challenge. I like the challenge. And that actually is true. I'm excited. I'm going to take on the challenges of the day. I hope you guys have some challenges that make you excited. Uh, I have a lot of things to record today, which may sound silly to be a challenge, but it is. It is to spend hours and hours recording all the time. There we go. Let's get some flask prepared because we have our eyes set on expanding into these areas. Very exciting, very exciting indeed. So let's go ahead, feed everybody, and check out what's going on down here. Oh, there's people here for the buggy. I gotta wait for little Avatar to feed everyone, and then it will be okay. And I better have some of the family come fertilize this whilst we wait. Did I already fertilize this? Oh, it's ready to harvest. Water chestnuts. I actually really love water chestnuts in my stir fry. Alright, let's harvest up that fertilizer bin really quickly. Come on, come on, Avatar, we can do this. Ooh, we get to make some more little desserts. The double cream is just so cute. No, I didn't want to do that right now. Oh no, I need more fertilizer rice. Ah, help! Oh my goodness, so much. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's just, there we go. Fertilizer rakes, please. Okay, there. Woo! Hello, peacocks. How you guys doing? There, now we've got some fertilizer rakes. What a busy morning. What a good morning. Maybe I should go, like, run a little bit to wake up. But yeah, so today I am working on Zoo Tycoon 2, and I need to get Pixelmon ready. And let's see, and just get some goals done. You guys might be seeing uh, some vlogs pretty soon about the goals I want to take on. So that should be a lot of fun. And this is over. So there we go. Put that little thing away. Nutmeg, you're barking at everybody! Hey, Isa! What you doing, Nutmeg? She's such a silly girl. Alright, let's put the cranberries down into the ground. There we go. Gather these up. Oh, look, and we can open up our, our um, little treasure chest. Sweet. Start building. Avatar's like, I'm doing 800 thing at things at once. Stop pressuring me. Hey, yeah, little horse, off to the pasture you go. Thank you, Isa. You're the one who made the horse prized. All right, let's hire some builders to help us construct this. Or open up the treasure chest, clear off the algae, and crack it open and all that. All right, gather that up. Darling, you missed a spot. There we go. I say that with love. Oh, prize chicken. Chicken's off. Jeez, Isa, you made a lot of my animals prized. That's awesome. Let's gather that up. And gather this up. 
But yeah, I'm getting excited. I have some goals, some health goals, some financial goals. Those ones seem kind of boring, but then I also have some goals for like where I want to travel this year. And by travel, I just mean like, you know, go to a park I haven't gone to in a while. All right, let's see. Let's get some ginger planted so we can start stocking up on our ginger for those ginger cookies. All right, is it all done, Avatar? Have you finished? The frantic running around, harvesting everything, part of the morning? I think she has. I think she has. So let's go ahead for Lysi's cranberries. Because we need a lot of um, fish again for one of our, our co-op orders. Yay! Cranberries. I hope, are we getting close enough for... I am not going to miss it this time. We only need 314 points for getting the next medal. I can't believe we like lost our medal. I'm still, I'm still sour pants about that. It really is like someone just walks into your home and steals it from you. All right, now it's time for the fun parts. So let's see what's going on at the buggy bouquet, bouquet buggy even. Can I make more of these? Not yet. Can I make more of these? Oh yeah, there we go. Yay! Another living chair any second now. Ta-da! Yay! All right, let's go ahead. We'll share those little little pieces. And now we have another chair that we'll put right here so the kids and I can sit around and enjoy some delicious little snacks. There we go. And I'm going to need to plant more irises. So I think actually I'm going to plant the irises over here. I love that they're adding so many permanent new crops too. For a while there, it seemed like all the new crops were um, just like special event crops, but then we got the irises and some of the other crops and I was so excited. All right, and then let's feed our little bees and see what we can do to help the co-op today. Because look, we're getting so close. We are getting so close. Only 10 more orders left, three more days. We wanna try to pull this off. So let's see. Let's see. It looks like we're going to be getting some carrots for Flossie today. I think that's something that we can pull off no problemo. All right, so there's that. She now has her rice paper. And let's go ahead and get some carrots down. And we can have our awesome farm hands help us out and our visitors. All right. Oh, look at that. Icha wants to help out, so that's a good thing. We can get the carrots put down there. Oh, Fo! Fo is actually taking care of some of the um, fields today. No problem. So I'll help out with that. There we go. And then we'll get these fertilized with our wonderful bees. And voila! Don't get your, your beautiful wedding dress dirty, Fo. Do be careful. All right. Icha. Go for it! And then Fo. Ah, hang on. Go for it! There we go. Had to reach real carefully. But there we go. So we'll work on this for Flossie real quick. What is going on here? I need to make two more potato salads and collect one more vegetable peeler. Okay, no problem. I'll see if I can get one more vegetable peeler for you. There we go. And gather all these up. Is that the last of the things? No, that's only level two on this Martha Stewsvort uh, event that Barbara, Barbara has her famous friend Martha Stewsvort showing up pretty soon and wants our help, which is absolutely adorable. Oh, I only have two farm hands? Zero farm hands left, huh? Well, that's not quite going the way I thought where there were like eight. So I guess we'll have to work on gathering the carrots for Flossie at another time, but at least we've got a few of them now. All right, and then Lori, hey Lori, another avid Farmville 2 player, always around, popping up and taking good care of our crops and animals for us. Thank you so much, Lori. All right, and then let's fertilize this. Lori, thank you so much. And then what do we have going on over here? Amber, hey Amber. Wonderful, well, let's go ahead and get these crops down. There we go, good, 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 good. Water them again. Fertilize the little group, there we go. And then Amber, you go for it. Cucumbers and delicious carrots coming right up. Ooh, that makes me want some carrots as a snack for lunch today. And actually, I, I highly recommend if you guys want to try to eat healthier, just surround yourself more often with like the foods that you want to eat, like carrots and like even just pictures. 
and it just works. It psychologically starts making you go, hmm, I think I want some of those. And the next thing you know, you're eating healthier. It's kind of amazing. And that's kind of one of my goals, uh, like I was talking about earlier, is to try to eat a little bit more healthy. Um, we really don't, like we don't eat out, we don't microwave our food because we don't have a microwave. We make almost all of our food from scratch. I don't eat uh, like junk food because vegan junk food's expensive. <laughs> but it's just about getting variety in your diet and making sure your portions are right and stuff like that. And I'm going to surround myself with some new foods. Like delicious new types of carrot. That's actually part of what makes gardening so fun. My friend, I want you to help, but there we go. Emily, hi. Oh my goodness, maybe we'll be able to get these carrots done anyway. And sheeps, my goodness, you guys are so awesome. Thank you so much for coming to visit today. Really helps get the morning started off on some great footage. Mm -hmm. Ah, this tea's so good. I hope you guys have something yummy and warm like tea to start your day with. All right, anybody hiding back here? I don't see anybody. We're gonna have to renovate, like totally redo everything once we get enough room. I'm gonna start visiting your guys' farms and trying to figure out what should I do? Like how, it'll be like, it'll be like when you look at, at magazines. I guess today is all about thinking about inspiration. I look at like, you know, healthy food websites. Um, not because I want the recipes really, because normally the recipes are more effort than they're worth, but it just gives you ideas, surrounds you with inspiration. And so we'll surround ourselves with inspiration of how we want to make our farm look by going to visit your guys' farms. Maybe we'll do that tomorrow. That might be a good thing to do tomorrow. Because the, the quests and everything are going nice and slow. We only have one. Normally we have like so many they start to go off the page. So this is kind of impressive. All right, we should probably see how many carrots we've got because maybe we've got enough carrots by now for Flossie. So let's check that out. Not anywhere near enough. <laughs> we have <laughs> almost half the amount of carrots that Flossie wants. What an expensive order. Oh my goodness, but it is worth it for the co-op. So, oh, and look, Darling's playing with Nutmeg. That's adorable. There we go. And that, well, at least we got mastery on our carrots. Are we almost there yet? Like, that was only worth six points? Ah! Well, at least we went up another- Oh, there's another friend! Yes, Riona, thank you! It is a carrot picking kind of day. I kind of want to look at all the different varieties of carrot now and see which ones I could get my hands on. When we move, we'll probably be closer to like, uh, Darling said there's like a Chinese market and there's, um, it's, it's bound to be like those bigger, ooh, let's see, all right, bound to be like those bigger city, uh, that's really health-centered city, so probably gonna have a lot of those places where you can go and get healthy food, like there's a Whole Foods there, um, we have a little farmer's market here, and we have a very expensive health food store, but that's about it. And the farmer's market is so overpriced and you feel bad because you want to support the local people. But I used to work for one of the people there and they really do mark things up because there's a lot of tourists. And so that made me kind of sad. I was like, oh, I can't afford a bunch of carrots. That is seven little carrots for $5. I'm sorry. <laughs> and they didn't taste good either. I did buy them. So we have King, our Basher, Madison, our Pryor, Merle, our Kicker, <laughs> I love that, and Shintaro, our Puller. Let's finish unlocking this and see what is hiding inside. And what's back here? Dun dun, dun dun. <gasps> Woohoo! Lots of nice fertilizer and moolah, that's wonderful. And we have some friends hiding back here too. Let's say hello. I feel like we need a horse pasture. All right, Craig! Hi, Craig! I hope you're having a good time. I'm pretty sure I saw a poor woman stuck behind like our cow somewhere. Hello? I could have sworn I saw somebody just now. All right. She vanished. I hope she's okay. Is she stuck in a tree? We'll have to keep an eye out for her. All right, and then we've got Julie. Julie is visiting and she is giving us more water. Oh no, and I missed that somebody helped us out with the field. That could have been more carrots. Fudge knuckles. And then Amia. Yep, there we go. So exciting to have like all of our friends just popping up. And Julie, you at least want to take care of this little field, which is very helpful, Julie. 
So I'm going to take care of that. And I think that's going to be it for now because we're so far away still from getting all of those carrots. So we'll work on pulling up those carrots with the next batch of farmhands that comes to visit. And we will just start putting down more, more irises, more beautiful irises, some mint, some other things for the co-op. Oh, I hope you guys can surround yourself with inspiration and ideas, colors, pictures, maybe go on a nice walk somewhere that has lots of cool stuff to look at, and, and just experience the variety of life. So I wish you a beautiful, wonderful day, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.